Hi guys, in this video I am going to discuss about tree view control in seesaw.net windows form. So let's go to toolbox and here search tree view and drag this in the form and hereafter let's click on a form. So this is the form, load even, it's open. Now here or let's write the tree view. So if you like to know about the tree view, so at your display a hierarchical collection of label items and each represents by a tree node. So it represents by a tree node and tree view is a type which is not valid in given context. So this is the thing about tree view or display the hierarchical collection of label items and each represented by a tree node. Now hereafter I need node and here I am creating the object of tree node T and here after T V dot nodes. So about the nodes, it's the collection of tree nodes that are assigned to the tree view control and uh, here after writing add method and here inside writing visual studio now here after writing we view one dot nodes so nodes add here I am going to specify the index 0 so here get and set the tree node specify index location in the correction. So at I am giving or 0 and here nodes writing nodes and here add method and inside writing at here visual studio. Now here of the tree dot here nodes and here zero index zero zero so one more index zero and here nodes dot add and here inside so here this is zero index at here I am giving C sum. And here ST dot name. ASP dot name. And here after or T view dots nodes. of zero index dot here nodes dot add method and here inside door code I am writing assembly containing I am code now here after p view dot nodes and here zero index dot here next writing one index here after nodes dot add and here in double code I am going to write b and l now here after oh, let's copy this line to save the times and the same index I'm going to write at here dot exe now here after or preview so next is at here or notes dot here writing add 
So add method here writing i e nomi river. And here after that space, so first is 0 and here after 2, so 2 index and here one more time nodes and here and so first I am going to uh, include and here 0 to index or uh, 0 and 2 index going to write at your inside i correction now here after let's uh, paste one more time so this is a 2 index and 2 of 0 2 of one more time or 0 at here nodes dot add so here i correction next i list so this is the tree view one example now i'm going to execute and also you before i'm going to execute here i'm going to make uh, this size bigger Here, let's execute. So here, I'm going to click on plus. So see at here inside visual. So this all are child. These are assembly containing i enumerable. And inside to these are you get one child or uh, ASP.NET. And this is a root. And inside assembly containing i. So here dot dll dot exe is the child and here uh, i enumerable. So inside i enumerable you get i uh, collection and inside i collection you get i list. So at here let's go to form and here. So this is the visual studio. So this is the root and here in zero index so this is the kid of visual studio and csr is the parent and here sp.net is the kid and here after assembly containing is the root and inside two kids or uh, dot dln and exe at the same index so this is a different index here this is a zero and here zero zero and here both are same index and here after i enumerable is the parent of i collection so i collection only i collection and inside i collection is the root of i list and i list it's the kid of i collection so this is the formation of tree parent and child formation so this is one uh, example by code now here after i'm going to also you one more example so here let's track trivia one more time and drag into the form now here after let's click on all this arrow now here after you can add it the nodes so at your first stage you need to add root so root name is node 0 so if you want then here you can change the color so whatever you like you can uh, take here after I am going to take one more color or uh, yellow and here after I am going if you want then you can give the name so I am giving at here the name V as and here after let's give meaningful text so at here I am going to write the visual studio and here take context so you should try to check this one so see at here when I uh, write the text, so here with text visual studio, so, so this has a change. Now if you want from here you can add the kid or child. So at here node 0 or uh, added. So here you have to give meaningful name. So inside to visual studio you get to csr.net and here 
and uh, ASP.NET. So I'm going to add one more child. So if you don't want here this one, so you can cross. So this gone. So inside here or C sharp, I'm going to add one more root. So at here I'm going to write ASP.NET. So this is ASP.NET. Now if you press down, so see at here ASP.NET it's added. Now if you want, you can add one more root. So at here this is for assembly containing IR code. Writing assembly containing IR code. Now inside assembly containing IR code, I'm going to add two kit. So here this is note file, and here inside of host is DLM direct link language, and this is for EXA. So here of so inside you can add one more root. So this root is for I enumerable. So I enumerable it's added. Let's give add a E. Now here of so inside going to add one more root. So this time going to give add here the name. Oh sorry or oh, text I collection. If you want from here you can edit or remove. So let's give add here i enumerable. Sorry, i correction. And inside i correction here I'm going to add one more orchid. So this is for I list. So here, see at your this is our tree created at your Visual Studio or is the root of all here csaw.net insert csaw.net here this is the uh, kid here this is the uh, root of dot dlr exe. Now let's uh, click on OK. So here this is created. Now let's execute. So here click on visual. See so so it's not to visual in the form. So what we need to do? Add here. Make this bigger. Now execute one more time. So see at here it's a displaying Visual Studio. So here. C soft is the kit, ASP.NET is the kit, assembly like containing is the root of dot dl. So here, yeah. so or two ways we can uh, create uh, or tree. So this uh, by coding here. Yeah. So you have to write this piece of coding, and here yeah, this is direct method. So at here uh, you can find different uh, properties inside or tree view. So whatever you like, you can take. So from here, you can uh, change the backer border style, and here you can give the meaningful name of trivia, and here this all things. So if you want, you can block the tree. So here you can't move this tree anywhere; it's blocked. And this all things, and here uh, this all event back color change before uh, check here uh, this all events available so according to project requirement you can take the events so this is the things about to tree view in csr.net windows application so i hope guys this video is helpful for you so now in this video it's over so thanks for watching see you next week thank you